Before we continue with the video, if you like what I'm doing here on this channel, please consider subscribing. It helps the channel a lot. Anyway, let's get back to the video. It is that time of the month again. We're getting free assets from the Epic Game Store, so let's check them out. So this is what is offered this month for free. We have a Pine Forest, a Mega Visual Effects Pack, a Castle Pack, a Reef Pack and a Horse Pack. So let's check them out more in detail. So this is the Pine Forest Asset Pack. This is the overview map. So if we take a look here, this is the overview map which shows you all the assets it consists of. So you have some uh, road textures for, uh, or actually meshes, this is a mesh. Uh, for splines to make roads and such, you have some rocks and some foliage. You also have some trees and some uh, buildings over here. And together with this, you can create a bunch of different uh, settings. So this is one example of that. So you have some of the trees and some of the foliage and a little bit of water here as well, along with some trees. And then they also provide a few different other maps to give you a, few, a little bit of a sense of what you can accomplish with them. And they describe it themselves as these are maps that you could use as sort of your start to build from if you wanted to. Uh, or you could just make use of their assets in an existing project if you want to as well. Here you can see them making use of the spline uh, road as well with that mesh. So there's a few different maps here with a little bit of a different feel, but overall fairly similar. Uh, should be a pretty okay map for you if you want to have something like already made and start out with, or if these are assets that you're actually looking for to add to your existing uh, development. Next up, we have the Mega Visual Effects Pack. And this is actually six smaller packs combined into one. Each pack is represented by these different levels. So in here, we're currently in the attack pack. So if we go and press play here, you can see sort of what we are going to be getting in this pack. You can see there are some projectiles over here on the right, which are arrows. We have some comets hitting the ground. We have some line attacks and we have some artifacts being created uh, on the floor as well with these special effects. So that's what's included in the attack pack. In the ice skill set pack instead we will have a bunch of different ice attacks. You have a really huge one over here and you have a ray and you also have some projectiles. So that's what's included in the ice attack pack. So again, these are pretty small. They consist of only a few different uh, things, but they are a bit varied at least, so you get a sense of what they could be used for. The third pack here is the pickup pack, which is actually, if you go to the store and click on this creator, you'll see that this has actually been offered before. There is a free pickup pack available in the permanently free collection. And that is essentially what we are seeing here. So we get to see the different pickups that are created and a few ways of possibly using them. And you also have some coins there in the background and some shields and a lightning effect and a star. And you can see that we can use them as sort of like debuffs or buffs above heads, so or you can use them around meshes like this with the lightning effect, where you can have something spinning around geometry like this. So it has a bunch of different use cases available for you to explore and uh, examine as well if you wanted to. Next up in this is the projectile VFX, which is going to be, as you might be able to guess already, about projectiles. So you have a few different colored projectiles here, which have explosion effects when they reach to the target. And you also have this big star that's running around over there. Next up, we have the ray map. The ray map consists of different ray attacks. So you can see them with different materials, giving very different feels about them. And that's what's included in this pack. And the last mini pack that this is part of is the shooting pack, which is uh, projectiles and explosions related to shooting weapons. So you have grenades and rockets and you have snipers and automatic rifles and then some stylized bullets as well. So that's the visual effects pack. Next up, we have the sunset modular medieval brick buildings. And this is the overview map where you can see all of the different parts that this consists of. And this set consists of about 120 modular medieval building assets 
and there's things like you see some foliage you see some small uh, pieces of um, uh, like staircases and, and things like that terraces but you also have things like walls and uh, corners and also towers and you also have some particle effects involved in this as well so there's a lot of stuff here you could use to puzzle together uh, something pretty cool and their demonstration map shows this off as well if we get it up like so and we go into simulate mode and then we full screen it so this is an example of what you can create with this pack so you can see you can actually create quite a lot of uh, variety with this despite it looking like it didn't have that many pieces the the pieces are very modular and uh, well put together as far as i can tell uh, there are these this uh, specific project is also supported by uh, unreal engine 5 however it is not using nanites meshes uh, they're supposed to be low poly meshes meant to be low poly for performance sake so that's why uh, but you can create something pretty nice out of this uh, based on what assets you get provided in this pack next up we have the reef kit and this one is the overview map so this one shows all the assets that are available in this you can see some cave entrances a boat light shafts turbines small pieces of seaweed of different forms and shapes some coral and rocks of different sizes and shapes and using this you can then create this example scene that they have which looks like this which is a very cozy little scene it is not very big uh, if you you can see also you have this nice little effect here like you're underwater which is of course just an illusion from that case or that viewpoint um, and yeah th there's not a whole lot of different assets here there's many small different ones uh, so you probably won't be able to make a very large scene out of this but for small areas this for sure can give you a very nice little finding nemo kind of uh, feel last up among the free ones this month is the horse starter kit um, this one has a little bit of a level here where you can start playing and you get some instructions that you can use the f key to call your horse and it will run to where you are you can also press e next to a horse and it will start a mounting animation you can then also hold down shift when you're mounted on the horse to gallop other than that it will trot or move around and you can see that um, you have some controls here for gamepad as well and they have created a little bit of a map so you can run around uh, with your horse and get a feel for what that looks like and the controls I feel that the controls are a little bit weird and also you can see that the horse sort of allows for a bunch of movements that you probably didn't want to do so you probably can't use this out of the box you probably have to uh, work on the animations to make sure that you have something that looks at least a little bit uh, realistic because it's a little bit crazy currently um, it's it's pretty nice though anyway uh, if you especially if you have the need for a horse you have some animations for it you have some different horses if you go and check the blueprint that is available for the horse you can see that you have a few different options available when it comes to the materials of the horse you have three different bodies so you can change to essentially have it look like three different horses when it comes to that you also have a few different uh uh, mains if you wanted to change that as well so so there are there are some options here for customization although not a whole a lot but some uh, so this if you're interested in something with horses this might be a starting point but it does need a little bit of work i would say and lastly we have a new pack or a new asset in the permanently free collection this is a commercial long-range aircraft this one consists of one aircraft and it has a few different other things you can detail it to make it look a little bit different uh, in addition to that it is also rigged so it has some things that are animated there are some moving parts so if you were to press simulate for, for example you can see among other things that the 
turbines are moving around. So you, you have some things here you can play around with when it comes to things like uh, landing gear and turbines and other things, uh, wing flaps and such um, to, to make use of if that is what you need for your project when it comes to this asset. So it's a very high detailed looking uh, aircraft. So it's pretty nice. It does, however, not have anything when it comes to interior. Uh, so it's only usable from a exterior point of view, essentially. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you did not like it, leave a dislike. Leave any suggestions or comments you have down below. Subscribe and share this video if you want to see more like it in the future. That is all for now. Keep on learning. Take care.